Hello everybody, my name is Jane and I'm so happy to see you again on our YouTube channel. Today we're going to talk about the difference between two similar courses, TOEFL Level 5 and TOEFL 120 hour. We are going to reveal the difference of such a level in our system. Also, we are going to discuss whether TOEFL Level 5 can help to earn more money and in the end we will decide what to choose. So if you are interested, keep watching. Yeah, definitely we have a lot of things to talk about, but before we start, let me remind you that this video is made for international certification. If you want to know more about us, go to our website TOEFL2SOLCERTIFICATION.COM So every year educational providers around the world release new TOEFL courses. And that's why such enormous choice makes English teachers a little bit confused and baffled. So we have so many questions in our mind. For example, what's the difference between completed hours and levels of TOEFL courses? Will such a course influence my salary? And what is the best option to take? But when it comes to the right choice, there are so many factors that you should take into account before you enroll into the next training. And after watching this video, you will be able to distinguish proper courses from false ones. So firstly, you should know some facts about TOEFL framework standards. So it goes without saying that TOEFL level 5 make us think that there are four former stages before. And honestly, there are eight levels at all. But why do we need such a scale? So first of all, such a level system was numbered by Ofqual. And this is a government department in England that regulates qualifications there. Also, it is important to know that all parts of the UK, such as Scotland, Wales and Northern Ireland, are in charge of their own educational area. In other words, there are different awarding bodies in each nation and there are fat chances to find a course regulated by the whole UK. So according to Ofqual system, the first level of TOEFL stands for General Certificate of Secondary Education, level 3 is equivalent to a high school level course, and only levels 4 and 5 match knowledge of second year student at university. So let's talk about our system of TOEFL courses. And usually we tend to think that TOEFL courses consist of hours that you need to complete in order to finish the course. And 120 hours is a bare minimum to take up in order to start your teaching career. So most of employers require exactly this amount of hours. And this is sufficient time to acquire and get familiar with essential information regarding ESL teaching. Needless to say that 120 hour course will provide you with decent offers and opportunities to take the best place. In other words, it won't help if you take and enroll in the course with fewer hours of study. Now, when you know all details about each course, you may wonder, and how is it supposed to help me to make the right choice? Fortunately, we have foreseen such a question and prepared rational facts to consider. So, a TOEFL 120 hours is better for you if you have a bachelor's degree in any major, if you have a work experience related to teaching English, if you have a citizenship of an English-speaking country or a high level of the language. And you should take up a TOEFL level 5 if you are a non-degree holder, there is no teaching experience, also if you are not from an English-speaking country and your English level is still room for improvement. So, according to Ofqual framework, CELTA course and TOEFL level 5 match the fifth level of teaching qualification. However, it relates to difficulty and complexity rather than meaning. In other words, if you have a question like are CELTA course and TOEFL level 5 equal, the answer is no. They are completely different courses in terms of way of studying and focus. As for CELTA, it suggests full-time learning in person for a month and keep focus on teaching only adults. Whereas a level 5 TOEFL qualification is about teaching people of different ages and allows studying online following your pace of life. All of them are appropriate to get a job abroad, and TEPL is more advisable than CELTA. However, in case when employers require having only CELTA, it's highly unlikely that TEPL Level 5 certificate will become an equivalent substitute. CELTA is preferred in English-speaking countries accompanied with work experience, and usually English teachers enroll in TEPL courses to get essential knowledge regarding ESL teaching and start working overseas. In a couple of years, they come back to get in CELTA course, and by this moment, they will have been ready to fit the bill. When it comes to payment, it costs about £1,000, and most English teachers enroll in it if they pursue academic achievements and professional development. When it comes to earning money, there is no proof to believe that a TOEFL level 5 increases salary drastically. So, of course, it will improve your resume and make you a privileged candidate, but there is something else. 
Educational field works different and sometimes huge teaching experience can influence pay even more than international certifications. So newcomers can anticipate having the same amount of money with any international qualification. Anyway, whether you have CELTA, TEFL Level 5 or TEFL 120 hour, chances to get a decent job increase and it will give you an advantage over other candidates. But play fair and don't set your own rules when it comes to work. Unfortunately, there is no the only external body which regulates TEFL courses worldwide. That's why scammers confuse people a lot. They can proclaim a course 120 hour, whereas in reality it takes two hours to complete it. And of course it's not a big deal to name a program TEFL level 5, whereas in reality off-call regulation has nothing to do with that. But thankfully there is the significant fact that can help to distinguish fake educational services from decent ones. Accreditation provides control and verification from respectful awarding bodies. In other words, a fraud provider will never get legitimate approval from an accrediting body. Some companies may try to convince you that they have regulation from Ofqual. However, in fact, it might be just an endorsement that cannot have the same legal power. When you get all information about TEFL courses, you have a chance to weigh all pros and cons up. And remember that any international qualification proves your hard work in professional development. Of course, it's impossible to become an ASL teacher overnight. However, every step makes you closer to your dream job. There is one more thing that can help you to find a good TEFL provider. It's a job search service, and it is as important as accreditation. Looking for a job takes some time, especially for newcomers in teaching English. So in other words, it's a long and exhausting process. Unfortunately, international certification provides so many different ways how to start your teaching career and to take the best place. Don't waste your time and enroll in online TAFL to sell course and purchase it at a 50% discount. Go to our website tafeltosolcertification.com to get the course program. So I hope this video will help you to make the right choice and we will be glad to answer your questions if you leave them in the comment section below. So thank you so much for watching this video, don't forget to subscribe and I'll see you the next time. Have a good day!